Welcome to Fun Islamic Facts, where I share fun facts about Muhammad and the Quran whenever jihadis go on a killing spree. Sahih al-Bukhari, number 5068, narrated Anas, the Prophet used to go round, have sexual relations with, all his wives in one night, and he had nine wives. Sahih al-Bukhari, 5215, narrated Anas bin Malik, the Prophet used to pass by, have sexual relations with, all his wives in one night, and at that time, he had nine wives. Sahih al-Bukhari, number 268. Narrated Qatada, Anas bin Malik said, The Prophet used to visit all his wives in a round, during the day and night, and they were eleven in number. I asked Anas, had the Prophet the strength for it? Anas replied, we used to say that the Prophet was given the strength of thirty men. And Sayyid said on the authority of Qatada, that Anas had told him about nine wives only, not eleven. Notice three things about these passages. First, Muhammad had at least nine wives at one time, even though Surah 4 verse 3 of the Quran limits Muslim men to four wives. If the Quran limits men to four wives, why did Muhammad have at least nine wives at one time? Well, Muhammad received a special revelation, Surah 33 verse 50 of the Quran, giving him, and him alone, the right to break the four-wife limit. How convenient. Second, Muhammad would have sex with at least nine women and girls in one day, even though he was more than 50 years old. Today, we would call him a sex addict. Isn't it interesting that a sex addict who claimed to be a prophet conveniently received a revelation giving him more sexual partners than anyone else? Third, how did Muhammad's followers know that he was having sex with all of his wives in one day? How did they know he wasn't simply chatting with his wives? It seems that the Prophet of Islam must have been bragging about all the sex he was having, so much so that his followers could in turn brag about him having the sexual strength of 30 men. Our Muslim friends tell us that Islam is a religion of modesty. A closer look shows that Islam is a religion whose supreme role model was a sex addict who built a religion around his sexual desires and constantly bragged about his sexual exploits with women, a prepubescent girl, and his slave girls. So much for modesty. 